Hello! Welcome to Anime Mystics. I'm Roman, and tonight I am watching Jujutsu Kaisen Episode 2. So, last episode we were introduced to our main character. Um, don't remember his name. <laughs> uh, I'll try to write it down after this episode or something. Um, but basically, he's not too normal in that he seems to be physically stronger than just about everybody at his school, um, including the PE teacher. Uh, I don't know how he does academically. They didn't bring that up, really. But he is in the uh, occult club, occult research club. He likes that one because it doesn't really require a whole lot of him doing anything, and he can leave at 5. Uh, I'm assuming he wanted to leave at around 5 because... At least in the first episode, his grandfather was in the hospital, not doing well. Um, but by the halfway point, his grandfather had passed away. Uh, he did get to talk to him one last time, so that's that was good. Um, then he signed all the paperwork that he needed to, to, I guess, get everything else taken care of uh anyway there was this other guy he's looking for this uh cursed item that apparently was at the school i think they were trying to him and whoever he's working for was trying to dispose of it because it's supposedly very evil and powerful but it was gone our hero had taken it <laughs> Uh, his friends were very interested into it, in it, and they wanted to uh, study it. So when the guy came to him saying, you know, uh, pretty positive you have this item because he can sense it on him. He was all, oh yeah, I did take that because he showed him a photo. And he's just telling him, you know, that I think every year like 10,000 people in Japan die from like curses and stuff like that. And starts explaining cursed items and uh, stuff and all that. And he tells him, you know, I'm going to need that item back. You know, I need it because I need to dispose of it. And he's like, oh, okay, well, here you go. And he hands him the box. Dude opens the box and the thing isn't in there. And he's like, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Where's the, the item that was in here? And he goes, I mean, I told you my friends were interested in it. Uh, they were planning on opening, like removing the seals tonight. Which this guy got very nervous about because you're not supposed to be removing these seals. <laughs> so they start heading to the school. They go back to his friends who are unsealing the item, which turns out to be a finger. Uh, and then this thing comes out from the ceiling. And yeah. Starts chasing them around the school. <sighs> Whew. Excuse me trying to one eat them and two get the cursed item um the other two show up the dude looking for the item actually goes in and tells him to stay behind because it's too dangerous so he goes in and he's starting to deal with this creature probably a demon or a curse I believe they talk about curses a lot, so it could have been like a manifestation of a curse. Um, and the other guy, he's thinking to himself, you know, should I stay here? He told me to stay, but grandfather told me that I should help people. So he goes in. For, again, pretty powerful, so he beats up this thing. Uh, he doesn't kill it, but he does get his friends free. And then the other guy kills it. But then this other curse from the uh, rugby field shows up attacks the other dude injuring him pretty badly almost gets the uh, finger but what's his name the main hero shows up gets it he ends up having to eat it to get like cursed powers and then he kills this thing but the creature that was that was uh, attached to the finger the curse starts trying to possess him and right now he's fighting with it <laughs> <laughs> and it seems like he's getting it under control 
the other guy is telling him that he's got to handle him because he's a curse now. And basically that means he's going to have to kill him. Stupid hair right here just sticking up. Okay, that works. Anyway. Yeah, so that was basically where it ended. So let's get into this and see what this other episode is about. Alright, so we're going to start this episode in three, two, one. <laughs> uh, he ate it. <laughs> yeah, for real. A little close there, aren't you? You wants to fight him, huh? <laughs> I'm going to eat it on the bullet train. Okay, I think they're going to need to repair the school. Or him, really. Knocking him out. Uh, keep an eye on him at least. <laughs> You're being executed. But he said he didn't want me executed. <laughs> I did my best.
Okay. So just 20 fingers. Well, 16 fingers and four thumbs. Are they going to have him find all 20, eat them all, and then just kill them when they're all inside of him? Yeah, okay. Help us find all, what, 14 parts? Oh, well, okay. Okay, so the other friend is in the hospital. Like, no, I believe you. Ah. Really? I'm sure.
Wow, really? Grandfather's ashes, huh? You're gonna eat it? <laughs> well, you didn't have any, uh, pro well, you did have problems with it yesterday, I'm sure, but you just did it. Oh, and how we can do it. Getting ready in case he needs to attack. <laughs> wow. Third first year. Okay, so you could stay there afterwards. Oh God, what's the principal like? <laughs> he pops out sometimes. Is that Sonic? <laughs> Jeez. 
<laughs> like Jennifer Lawrence. I was told to be here. like a dog copper. Oh, there he is. Oh. <laughs> You pass. I had to get one last hit in, didn't you?
They're already putting up posters. That's supposed to be Jennifer Lawrence. <laughs> You're next door. <laughs> oh, watch your hand. Oh, okay. It wasn't just your hand. Is that a female? The only thing missing in this group is a female. There she is. It's a cool little dollar. <laughs> this is the ending theme? Wow. This is not what I expected for an ending theme. But it's pretty cool. I wonder if I'll see the other two again. From the old school. Yep, alright. Wrong one. Uh, where are you? There we go. Okay. Took me a little bit to find that. Anyway. Okay. Uh, little calmer episode here. Not as uh, crazy as the last episode, but now we're actually getting into, I guess what the story is about I know it was going to be about curses and stuff but I figured there was only going to be like one finger from this guy I didn't think they were going to try to find 20 have him eat them all and then kill him <laughs> so they could kill the curse um, but okay I mean I don't know if that's actually what's going to happen I don't know if this series is over now like, if there's enough material to do the whole thing, or if it's still ongoing. Um, getting 20 fingers seems like it's going to take a while, so I would assume this is going on for a bit. Uh, 
even a, is this a manga? Pretty sure this is a manga. Let's check this out. Where are you? There you are. Okay, well, it's 24 episodes. So... I still don't think that's going to be enough to do everything. And this is a manga. So let's take a look at this. Oh, you can read it on uh, Viz. Oh, wait, there's a, there's a good question. I didn't answer my question, but okay. It says it wants the author will hopefully wrap up the story in 21 volumes, which means it'll be around 200 chapters. Let me see. I think it's only at 118 right now. One twenty five it looks like. So another seventy five chapters maybe, depending on if that's actually when it's gonna finish or not. Uh but yeah, definitely enough material to do multiple seasons. I'm pretty sure this is gonna do very well. Uh a lot of people seem to be really into this show. The animation is really good. The action scenes are really good. The characters are pretty cool. So, yeah, I could see it going on for at least two or three seasons. Uh, maybe four, depending on if that's what's going to finish off the manga. Um, but, yeah. Really liking the show so far. Um, I hope we don't just finish up with those, with those two friends from the other school. I wonder if we'll see them again. Like, if maybe they'll... I don't think they'll transfer to this one because I don't think they had any kind of ability that would help out. But, you know, who knows what could happen. Well, other than the people that read the manga. <laughs> okay. So if you enjoyed this reaction, be sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons and get updates on our releases. Check out our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for anything else we decide to post. And check out our Discord where you can chat with me or anyone else. It's also a good place to go to see if there are any updates to the channel. So until next week. Bye.